As if rising from the very depths of the underworld, a second bristling wall of hulls appeared. This time, an unbelievable 40 Gabiniani death ships faced our lone heroes. Then another ship rose behind the fleet, the size of which has never been seen before or since. 10,000 warriors crowded its massive decks, smashing sword and spear against brazen shield. This may have been the largest fleet ever to sail the Mediterranean. Silence! Fell like a rock. Suddenly, 100 balls of fu- The way they spring from the fog, it is like a nightmare. Ah! Don't let their tricks trouble you, Damascus. It's a rule to shake our nerves. They gain nothing by it. And the flames! The fire is in The heroics were spectacular. They fought like gods. But it was all to no avail. Yes, more ships appeared. A vast burning armada of war bore down upon them as it sent from Mars itself. The crew fell, but were born up again by the wild, thunderous cry of their fearless captain and the goddess. Yet more ships from the east! And these balls! This must be the fault out of these bastards! There! Gods and beasts! This is it, slackers! We win or we die! La la la! Repent to it! Aya! They must be! Slackers all written to me! Crimes will break their pants writing on this day! On this blood smeared ocean! We'll send these cursed Gabriani to the underworld! Let's see them tell that story without tears running down their faces! The gods themselves will lift cups to our glory! Steady, old man! Let's not beg the gods! Try cars! No! Speedo! Victory! By Amon! Well done, all! And that is the game! Ah, la, 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 la. and the goddess sailed into legend over the backs of ten times ten thousand drowned Gabiniani. I tell you, I weep just to tell of it. And they say, if you whisper a prayer into a wave or a fold of the sea, you can hear their war cry answer back. Alala! Alala! And that is how it happened. To a word. What a tale. If the goddess name was Aya, and a goddess she truly is. That may be the only honest part of the story. What is truth? All is permitted in the realm of greatness. One must believe in the act of creation, or else they will join the Gabiniani. You are a fine storyteller, Seni. Though I cannot tell if you are playing a game with me or telling a story. They are one and the same, my friend. Married to each other, like the oceans and the rain. Alala! You see it now! <laughs>
That Roman scum Flavius forced me to murder my child, my only son. Flavius has taken their wits. This is not good, or natural. Will they dance till their feet bleed? Stop, Meneruka! I beg you! Find my sacred oath. I am sorry. It is just... he was such a gentle soul. Once had me treat a wounded dog he had caught in a snare. Why would he do this? I have seen this before. In Siwa. I'm looking for the sole leader responsible, Flavius. The proconsul? That sack of rancid god shit murdered my son, raised my village, and now marches through your land with the light of Amunra. Come. Let us search the farm. Look for survivors. I am Bayakusiwa. Braxila, of this land gone mad. Why would Flavius. They are just poor Siwan farmers. They stood in his path. left alive. Women, children. Perhaps someone is hiding. Nanette? Are you all right? What happened here? Red cloaks and that milk soup with the lion's head. Took anyone who could work. Farm hands, my son Kade. Everyone. Then he came. Dark eyes hooted as a raven. I wanted to throw stones to shoo him off. Something golden, bright in his claws. Held it up, crowing as they fell before him. Some by their own hands, others by those dearest to them. Against nature, everyone crying, screaming, running, dying. How did you as... No one sees poor Linnet. An old woman's husk with clouded eyes. But I saw them. Didn't cry out. Bit my tongue till I choked on the blood. The men who did this? We will find them. Bitter hurry, girl. Raven flew north to the home of the huntress. Overheard red cloaks squawking. Bring Kade back to me. I will try. Flavius also robbed me of my boy. 
Let us bring Nenet to my cart. Will you follow Flavius? I must. For your son? For every son. You must miss him very much. All my waking and sleeping hours. You will see him again in the field of reeds. I hope so. Nenet spoke of the home of the Huntress. Yes, Cyrene. The shining porticos of Roman conquest. It is north of here. If Flavius is there, I will find him and destroy every fiber of his car. When you arrive in Cyrene, look for my friend Diocles. I would trust him with my life and yours. As a magistrate, he hears petitioners in the Agora. Give him this. I hope this heals the madness in this land. I pray you get the justice you seek, Bayek. Why would they take Nenet's son, Kade? The citadel casts a long shadow over Cyrenaica. There are rumors that General Agrippa and Flavius are preparing for war. Against Egypt? Do you doubt their ambition? No. They won't stop until I stop them. I will bring Nenet to my clinic in Balagrey, south of the temple of Asclepius. Though that place has troubles enough. I will find you if I can. Do you hear the beautiful music? I must honor him, Flavius, the leader, our liberator, the lion. sent me to find you. By Iset. Is that you, by Siwa? Let me out and out. I will paint his name on every wall from here to Rome for the whole Republic to see. Toes. Don't want any surprises. No surprises. Don't worry, my thanks. You have done me a good time. No one is with them. 
not let anything through. Have a death wish to come here. Hey, I got this feeling. The farm you came from, I saw what Flavius did. How he sucked the life from our people. My mother, Nenet, is she all right? Yes. Praxila took her to Balagre. Thank you, Bayek. You protect us even this far from the land of our ancestors. Why did the Romans bring you here? To feed their hunger for war and conquest. They have Ballista. We load it with a substance of hideous, burning devastation. Vitruvios, a Roman engineer up at the aqueduct, invented it. Vitruvios? I know this man. I cannot believe you would make something like this. We are free of those Roman tyrants. Vitruvius! We need to speak! What's the fuss, my friend? I believed you when you said you cared for the sea ones here. And all the while they are more at the Citadel, forced to work on a weapon you created. It is not what you think. Walk with me, and we'll get to the bottom of this. Please understand, Bayek, I was not always so focused on architectural wonders such as this aqueduct. As a hot headed <laughs> youth, I came up with many means of death and destruction. One of those was a Greek fire of sorts. Greek fire? A substance with such potential for unspeakable suffering, I vowed never to produce it. Well, the general is producing it. And forcing sea ones to arm his ballista for a war against their own country. should have burned my notes. General Agrippa must have found them. Then Agrippa must be stopped. Do what your conscience dictates, Bayek. But understand, I cannot be part of a plot against a Roman general, no matter how I may feel personally. Recover the formula, and I will destroy it. 
I will not have the immolation of Egypt on my conscience. Jove protect you, Bayek. I should be cautious around here. Yeah. <laughs> 